fifth stage of the Amgen Tour California, Liquid Gas Cannondale's Peter Sagan came by the Road Bike Action Office for an autograph session and a ride. Peter swore he was going to take it easy on us on the 40 mile ride, but his easy is a little different. While Peter cruised along on the ride, I was able to ask him about some of the upcoming events that he has on his calendar. He was candid about his chances in the Tour de France, the Olympics, and the World Championships. He says that Team Liquid Gas Cannondale will be riding for Nibali in the upcoming Tour de France but he will have one or two riders to help him in the sprints. As far as the Olympics go, which follow the Tour de France by one week, he thinks his chances will be good at a gold, for a gold medal. Who does someone like Peter admire in the peloton? He says Tom Boonen is the type of rider he would like to turn into. The same rider that he beat in stage eight for his fifth victory. His goal is to be a top classics rider, with Tour of Flanders being his priority in the next couple years to take victory in. Peter was the ultimate professional. Even though he could have ridden much faster, he kept a mild pace where everyone was able to keep up and regroup at the top of each climb. He offered advice for all the riders out there looking for ways to improve their own racing or riding. The young 22-year-old had a great personality. You never know what you're going to get when you have someone this talented and this young. Oftentimes there's a fair bit of arrogance that comes with it. But Peter was friendly, self-confident, but not overly confident. Unfortunately, the weather conditions weren't the best for our, the ride we were doing. 30 to 40 mile an hour gusts for the day made it a lot tougher than what we're used to out here. After eight stages of hard racing at the Amgen Tour California, Peter still pedaled effortlessly next to us. His light pedaling style and smooth look on the bike showed his class. Peter didn't even need to be out riding with us that day since he was flying back to Europe that very afternoon. But he made a bunch of new fans in the road bike action office. It'll be exciting to see how Peter develops over the next couple years. Thanks to Peter and Cannondale, Road Bike Action had the best lunch ride ever.